So this is an MUA haul. This is a makeup artist haul, okay? Um, Cause the purpose of these brushes are for my kit. They are not for me, they are for my kit. Brushes, bitches, okay? So, guess what, my lovelies, my lovelies, my lovelies. Like, I don't know if y'all know this, but like, low key, I have turned into a brush junkie. So, I have been like literally on the hunt, waiting for a Crown Brush to bring back, bring back on Hulk Look the Infinity Brush Set which I'm okay like here is like these are the four little ones right and so these are like identical like I would not be surprised if this was the actual brush that Sigma has because I know Crown is like a major manufacturer distributor whatever of these like uh, private label type deals where you can get a brush and you put your own logo on there but I have to actually see what and feel the Sigma ones to kind of get an idea of what but I'm, I'm kind of I don't know they're so super identical like it's almost astounding like they've been on there once and I missed it that one time I missed it and like they were like I mean sold out so fast yo like so fast like I am so obsessed with this set because it was for $35 like I'm obsessed like I want it I want two I want one for me and I want one for my kid like I want two of these sets I don't know why I'm just fucking obsessed right now <laughs> This whole entire collection on Sigma is 109 with the big brushes and the smaller brushes. So just these four alone on Crown were $15 and some change, like close to 16 bucks, 51, 61. It's still cheaper um, than the Sig Max, which is cool, but not 35 damn dollars. You feel what I'm saying? So this is why I'm really trying to get these joints at $35 because yo, that, you can't beat it. So this is like the round, they're like kabuki, it's supposed to be like a kabuki. And they're like precision face brushes, okay? And so according to Sigma, on Sig Sigma's uh, YouTube page, okay? They like kind of demonstrate how they use uh, all these brushes. So this one is like the kabuki round and this is supposed to mimic like your finger. It's supposed to mimic the shape of your finger so it's good for like eyeshadow primer right so that's exactly how I'm gonna use this baby too because I got a gig tomorrow so I'm gonna use this joint I can't wait so you just you know eyeshadow the primer this is what it's supposed to be something like your finger but you also can use it down here to buff out concealer stuff like that this angled uh, kabuki brush type deal and they're very dense nicely packed like me I'm gonna use this to contour because I can get that wider line when I use the brush like this you know what I'm saying? And if I want to get something very uh, tapered and chiseled and, you know, more defined, I can use the tip of the brush like that, or I can use these. So according to Sigma, this is more of your like, uh, this is your flat top kabuki, smaller version. And you would use this for spot correcting. And you would just use this to dab. And I used this actually the other day to spot correct and it worked pretty good. And you just dab it in there and you can buff out around it and blend it out. You know what I mean? Cause they're very densely packed. And so when you, um, when you buff it out, it really does give a nice, um, smooth airbrush type so I like that and then this one is like a um pointed a pointed one um I forgot what it's called but it's like a pointed blending brush and so this is good for I like to use this under eye just to blend under the eye and that way I can get in here and get in here and then like also I can use the powder directly on here to set um, under the eye with the powder. So I like this brush too. And I can't wait to get the bigger ones. I'm so excited. I'm really, really, really hoping that Crown, please hear my plea um, to put this brush set back again on Halt Look. For $35, the whole entire set, I promise you they're gonna sell out again, okay? So thanks, that's a good look for that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, so because the last time that Crown did um, have a sale on Halt Look, they did not offer this infinity brush set. They didn't offer it at all. So, ah, what I got instead is a substitute. Oh gosh, I settled, I did, but it was not a bad settle. It was still, so they had a 15 piece set. 
which I thought was super cool. So it comes in, it came with the case like this, but it didn't come inside the case. This is a nice little whatever case. I would I would throw this brush roll in my in my kit. Like I probably will use this brush roll in my kit because I'm gonna need it to carry these brushes. It comes with this jumbo fan brush. Look at it. It's like so freaking soft. It's like so freaking and soft. I like to use these brushes. When I use them on clients, I like to use them more so to like clean up under the eye or say I contour too damn hard. Like I, I like to use this to, to buff out the contour. Like if I want to dust them, um, it just depends on you know what I need. It depends on what's available. Like if I'm if I'm going through the motions and like I'm and I need a brush to do a job. Like because brushes have more than one function. Like it's just whatever brush I grab for whatever job that I happen to do at the time that I just happen to grab for. So it's like I can I can do so many several things with this. Like you know I, I you can do so many things with this. Okay. Brush. So another brush that came in this set is a flat top kabuki type bronzer brush but this one this one would be good probably like for mineral powder it would be good for regular powder i can swirl it in there and i can stipple it on the um what would be really good to use because the fibers are not as densely packed there is it's, it's a lot of space in there they're not real tight you can wet the brush and then you dip it in your powder boom 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 boom, boom, boom. and then you can buff it out so you can use so that's a good brush i like this brush um, this would be like an all over powder brush, a domed fluff, a domed powder brush. So you could use this for blush. You can use it for all over powder. It's not big enough for me for all over powder, but you can use it for all over powder or you can use it to dust away powder under the eye, whatever. All right. Your standard foundation brush. Mm, very nice. Feels very good. And this is your angled contour blush angled contour brush right here and they're not um they're short brushes like when i compare it to a standard size like brush they're very short brushes they're short they're stubby they're stubby yep which is very stiff, but you need a nice stiff brush, I guess, or the comb. And it has an actual label, Brow Lash Groomer, says it. Oh. All right, then it comes with a spoolie for eyebrows. I wouldn't use this for anything else. I would not use this for applying any mascara because I use disposable wands for that. So I would just use this for eyebrows as well. I would not brush. I'm thinking this is more of a lip brush. Oops, I don't touch my lip. All I can do is outline something with this brush though. I can't put no lipstick on with this brush. Does it say what it is? Cause I would probably use this as, as an eyeliner brush too. I don't know. I have disposable little thingies for lip brushes, but I don't like those either. I don't know, man. I gotta figure it out. Here is like, this is like your regular flat eye shadow brush. Just a regular flat eye shadow brush. So, um, just probably a larger eye shading brush, like an eye shader. So you could probably do some blending with this. You can do some blending with this. You can probably put color, deposit color into the crease with this type of, with this brush as well. You don't have to use a blending brush. You can use this type of brush to deposit color into the crease. This was the blending brush. Okay. Here is an angled eye brush. All right, again, angle brushes are very good for depositing color into the crease as well. You can do blending with these. All right, um, these are also good too for um, doing the inner eye contour. These are great for that too. If you want to just like flip color up on the side right here, you're like you're like a, a cat eye, this is good for that too because you just use the shape of the actual brush to create the, sh the, you know, to dictate where you place the color on the eye to do the shading on the eye. 
Um, I know I sound like I know what I'm talking about, right? Because I really feel like I do though. Like even though I'm still learning as far as like real world experience and actually like working with different skin tone, skin types and, and, and trying to problem solve and, and navigate my way through that. Like I have learned a lot about the tools that I've been using because I, I, I'm, I'm studying, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm studying this because this is something I want to do. So I study. Oh, excuse me. So this is a um, concealer brush. Okay. So this is a pencil, a pencil brush, a pencil crease brush, because it's tapered like a pencil, like a writing tool. It's very, very small. I mean, you know, small enough. All right. Then here you have an angled, angled eyeliner brush. But the hairs are so thick to me. I think it's very wide for eyeliner brush. I don't know if I can really get a very thin line with this brush. And my All right, so that is my crown syntho set and I am absolutely in love. I cannot wait to pack these jokers up and to use these. I can't wait to use them. So thanks for rocking with your girl. I appreciate your time and you spending it with me. Thank you so much. All right. So I'm out, about to finish getting myself together for tomorrow, finish washing my brushes and packing up my kiss so I can just pack it up in the car in the morning because I don't want to sit in the car overnight because I don't want my makeup to be all cold and stuff. So, boop. If you like this look, thumbs up this video for spending this time with me. I really and truly greatly appreciate it. Thank you. Make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe. Check out my last video, guys. My March, April favorites. Later. The makeup, baby.